This week I got a new car, the Ford Escape Hybrid. And the beauty about this car is it's got Ford Pass, which has got a hex integration into Home Assistant. Let me show you what works and what doesn't work. So the Ford Escape is a medium size uh, hybrid SUV. Um, so I was interested to see how this whole hybrid system worked as I hadn't had one of these before. And what really excited me about this car is this Ford Pass, which basically is an app that allows you to connect to the vehicle permanently. So you can lock, unlock, you can remote start. So you can basically start it and get it to warm up for you before you get into the car in the morning. Now, something that really excited me about this was that there's a hex integration into Ford Pass, as you can see. And I thought I would give this a bash to see how it worked. I should install the Ford Pass um, integration. All we need to have is hex. I'll put a link in the description below as to how to install the hex. Um, once you're in hex, just go here and we want to search for Ford Pass. There we go. Ford Pass, home integration for Home Assistant. So we just click on that and we download this. There we go. I just went for the latest release here. And once it's downloaded, we will need to restart our Home Assistant. And then we, so once you've restarted your Home Assistant, we just go down here to settings and we want to go devices and services and we want to add an integration. And now we just select our Ford Pass. There we go. Here it is there. All right, all we need to do now is put our username in, our password, and the VIN number of the vehicle. I've selected Australia because I'm in New Zealand, so I guess that was the closest one, and submit, and then all of your entities will show up in Home Assistant. After playing with this integration for a while, there's some things that work and some things that don't work. So the door lock does work. If I press lock, it will lock the car. However, the unlock doesn't seem to work and the ignition startup does not seem to work. So I'm quite happy. Actually, it's quite nice. I can have it just lock the doors of my car at night in case I forgot to lock it. Um, on the sensor side of things, really good to see that the um, whether the alarm has been set at night. That's pretty good. Uh, battery status, not too worried about that. Fuel, great to see um, what my fuel level is at so I could set some alerts for that for example um the over here another really cool thing odometer so that tells me where i'm at with uh, the mileage um, could set me reminders around servicing things like that um, other than that windows yeah good to know that your windows are closed as well so it could be right to run a little bit of an automation at the end of the day check everything's locked if it's not locked lock it check the windows are closed etc but overall Seeing as it's a hex integration, I'm pretty impressed with this. That's all for now. Have a great week. Bye then.